going to sit here and wait. And I'm going to start the Republic of Dave quest. Oh shit. What the fuck? Fucking dog meat. Don't worry, I got it. I never, uh, went back to my house and dropped my stuff off. Dog meat, stop opening doors. Hey. Hi there, honey. Have you spoken to Dave? No. Hey, Dave. I am Dave, president of the Republic of Dave. You will address me as Mr. President, or I will have you executed. Now, are you applying for a citizenship, <laughs> asylum, or just vacationing in the Republic of Dave? Uh, most exalted President Dave, I am ambassador from the waste. I'm an ambassador from the waste. You are? Excellent. It's good to see that the wasteland has finally recognized the sovereign republic of Dave. If the people of the wasteland are generous and respectful, I might deign to annex them. Anything happening in this place, Mr. President? There's an election for the next president. Don't look so surprised. Can't you see this is a republic? I really wouldn't know. I just got here. Ah, a seeker of knowledge then. Well, trust me, an election is what separates a president like myself from a monarch like my father. So your father was a monarch and your president? How does that work? My father inherited his political power from birth and renamed this great nation the Kingdom of Tom. Although I also inherited my political power from my father when I took over, I formed a republic so the people may elect their leader. Can I help with the election, Mr. President? All right, sure. Why not? The people have a tendency to wait until the last minute to vote, but I'd like just to get it over with. I'll spare a few caps if you just tell each of the adults to get over to the voting booth sometime today so I cinch the victory. Not that I have anything to worry about. The people know who their leader is in this republic. Tell me more about the republic, Mr. President. The Department of Tourism usually handles all questions for outsiders. Make it quick. So you're in charge of here, Mr. President? That's right. As President, I am head of the Department of Tourist Rights, the Office of Immigrant Affairs, and the Bureau of Dave-like Activities. My proudest duty, second to the Presidency, is Commander and Chief of the Army of Dave, the most ruthless military in the Wasteland. I'd be interested in learning more about you, Mr. President. Years ago, I freed these poor people from the wrath of Tom, former monarch of the kingdom of Tom. Afterwards, the people naturally elected me as their president, and the Republic of Dave was formed. Any future plans for the Republic, Mr. President? Well, the Republic of Dave is the only true sovereign nation in the wasteland. The only really civilized place left in the world. One day... All Wastelanders will be citizens in the Republic and know the greatness of their president. That's all I need to know. Well, good for you then.
Did you already vote, Mr. President? Of course I voted. I was the first to vote. Now I'm just waiting for the rest of the votes to come in. I have to go now. Very well. So, is this not an actual quest? No. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Um, I guess, is it council seat? Dave says you're okay? Fine. You should go vote if you haven't already. I guess you're right. I'll go right now. Hey, I'll... I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. You should go vote if you haven't already. You're right. I'll go right now. Done. Dave's the best. You guys are hip... Or not hypnotized, brainwashed, I guess. What's the difference? Hi. Hi, do you vote? It makes me feel safer knowing you're around. Hey. Come on, make it fast. I got chores. You should go vote if you haven't already. Fine, I'll get out of the way. Oh no. Let's get class started. Fuck. Damn it, my game's fucked up again. Quit. <sighs> yes. Play. Hey. Hi. Hey. So, Dave gave you the okay, huh? Well, welcome then. I run the Museum of Dave, where the children of the Republic can learn about their heritage. You should go vote if you haven't already. Oh no. Dave sent you to tell me that, didn't he? I'll go right away, I promise. Hi. Oh, wait, hold on. Should I not be saying that to people? Is she coming out? Um, yeah. I guess she already left. Good luck, Dave. You have my vote. Man, I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. I'd like to discuss this election with you. Election time is always exciting around here. I'd like to throw my hat into the ring. And run for presidency. Um, did Dave say you could do that? Did you? Um. Anything else? Goodbye, Rosie. Goodbye. Take care of yourself. The Brahmin smell awful today. Should I have, like, said I that first? Voting for Dave is the patriotic thing to do. <laughs> Morning. Is that everyone? Ah, Dave, lead our republic to glory. Out with it, Ambassador. This republic isn't going to run itself. I'd like to discuss this election with you. The election is still going on. What do you want to know? Looks like all the votes are in, Mr. President. Good. The votes are in. If you'll excuse me, I'll be getting started on tallying the numbers. Oh, yes. I almost forgot. Here's your caps. Keep this up, and I may deign to make you a citizen in a few years. Hello. 25 caps. 
It's locked for a reason. Don't get any ideas. Okay. Let's see what we have here. A vote for me. And another vote for me. Hey. Hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Well, looks like another triumphant victory for myself. Yes? What can President Dave do for you? Mr. President, do you know a ghoul named Mr. Crowley? There's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Before the people elected me president, I worked with a mercenary named Mr. Crowley. We were part of an expedition to Fort Constantine. What happened on the fort, Mr. President? Two of us died, including Crowley. The rest achieved the mission goals and were paid. Crowley is alive, Mr. President. I'm supposed to bring back proof of your death. Alive? I always wondered. He was locked in with a bunch of feral ghouls. They won't attack ghouls, you see. Would you consider taking him a personal item, like this key, and just telling him you killed me? Mr. President, what's so special about this key? You need all the keys to get through Fort Constantine. With only one key, there's no point in my going back. A gift of the key would be a strategic diplomatic move, Mr. President. Hmm. Of course it would. I knew that. I was just testing you to see if you would realize it. Here, take the key. It is a gift from the Republic of Dave to the Wasteland. I have to go now. Very well. He is kind of annoying, but... It's none of my business to fuck up what he's got going on. He's, he's annoying, but... Okay, kill Ted Strayer and get his key. Who's Ted Strayer? I don't know who I'm going to right now. Uh, Dukov and his key? But Ted Strayer must be the guy that's here because we know where Dukov is. Hey. Ted Strayer. You can chill with me if you want, dude. Sounds like a plan, man. Alright. You and me just hanging. Do you know a Mr. Crowley? Whoa. That's a blast from the past. My dad knew a dude named Crowley. I never met him, though. I think dad said he died when they were checking out some old fort. Do you know what they were doing at that fort? Nah. He said that old man Tenpenny hired him and some other guys to go in there. But he never said why. My dad made enough caps off it to set him up good, though. What do you know about Tenpenny? Everybody knows he runs Tenpenny Tower, but I never met the dude. I swear. Can you think of any reason he might want you dead? No shit. That dude wants me dead? If you give me something personal of yours as proof, I'll lie to Crowley. Whoa. Is this, like, worth caps? Because I got needs, man. Give me that key. I'd hate to see you bleed to death. Uh, sure, dude. I don't know what it's for anyway. Don't need to get all thug-like. I don't want him to die anyway. 
Uh, Dukov. I don't really care about Dukov, though. But he never did anything to me, so... Give me your weapon. There it is, it's fully repaired. Oi, Pitbull. What you need? How about a drink? No? Suit yourself. Someone said you might know a Mr. Crowley. Care to comment? He's fucking dead, that's what I can tell you. Feral ghouls ripped his nuts off and ate them for dinner. Where did he die? Uh, a little shithole called Fort Constantine. It fucked us up, but good. Where is this Fort Constantine? It's northwest of here, numbnuts. A long fucking walk, too. Wankers like you can't get in, though. Uh, you need a special set of keys. How did all of you meet? Ten Penny hired us as mercs. He wanted some fancy fucking gun. Don't know how he got Crowley to sign on. Ten Penny fucking hates ghouls. So it was just you and Mr. Crowley? <laughs> no clown shoes. Ten Penny hired a whole fucking team. Stray, Crowley, Tara, Dave, and me. Tara had a pair on her. Oh, <laughs> sweet Jesus, they were nice. Ha <laughs> ha. That place fucked her up more than I did, huh? The rest of us went our separate ways after that. Actually, Crowley is alive. I was supposed to kill you and bring him proof. So, the meat bag is alive, huh? And I bet I know what he wants. But I don't know what you want. What's your angle, clown shoes? 62%. We have a hundred speech. Give me something I can use as proof that I killed you or else. You got some big brass ones, you know that? And fuck me if I don't think you could do it. Here, take this key. It's all he really wants anyway. Now go fuck yourself before I change my mind. What you need? How about a drink? No? Suit yourself. I'd better leave. Don't let the door hit you in the ass, clown shoes. Ha <laughs> ha! I wonder why that was 62%. That was weird. Well, I didn't shoot any of them in the head. Underworld journey. Are they all dead yet? Did you bring me any proof? Here's Strayer's key, but I'm afraid he's still alive. Uh, I put a bullet right between Str Ted Strayer's eyes. So the ghoul hater got what was coming to him. Good riddance. Here's your caps. I'll take that key. Alistar Tenpenny is already dead. Damn. He's the one I most wanted to die by my hand. At least he's dead somehow. Here, I'll give you 25 caps for the news, but I'm not going to pay you to kill a dead man. Dukov is dead. I blew his brains out. Excellent. That'll be a lesson for all the ghoul haters out there. Here's your payment for the key. 
Dave's head popped like a zit. Serves him right. He won't be spreading lies about ghouls anymore. I'll take that key, and here are your caps. Why 62? Tell me more. Tell me where Fort Constantine is. It's pretty far away, northwest of here. Knowing won't do you any good with these keys, though. What can you tell me about Underworld? It's a place for ghouls. Here we're just people, not monsters. There are too many places where a ghoul can't get a fair shake. I have to go now. Well, they may not all be dead, but I have the keys. I should have hired a better mercenary. Run along. I have a trip to plan. Yes? This is our town. Keep your best hands to yourself. Are you really going to walk there? You haven't seen any of those keys, have you? You seem to have lost them. It's kind of annoying. Like, none of them hated ghouls, really. I mean, they might, but Ted Strayer doesn't seem like he would hate a ghoul. And D Dave does, but he didn't really say anything about... about, uh... about... him being a ghoul. That guy I was just talking to, Crowley. Whoa! I really need to go home. I should have went home first. We can't get him from here, dog meat. I gotta kill him. Gotta walk the whole way up here. Really surprised I could jump up there. Did they go in? Oh, they went in the building. So they could come down. Alright, let's go back to Megaton really quick. Oh yeah, we should check off Lincoln's repeater. Uh, right there. And we should put this in there and that in there. I want to keep that because I want to go. Or let's go talk to Gob and tell her him about Carol, and then we'll go to this guy. The, this guy. I'll go to that party, that ghoul that had a birthday party. If I can remember where it is. Fallout 3. It's I think it's in
Gallo, is that his name? Uh, where's he at? County Sewer Main Line. I think it's near Greyditch. cigarettes on us and other stuff god damn it Weigh a lot. It's also probably because I have a stealth boy, all my stealth boys on me. Yep, that's why. Oh, yeah, let's go talk to Gob. See if you can go back to her. I wish God there damn were it. more people like you in the world. I want you to have this. I hope it helps keep you safe. Thanks. Bless you. Gobby, 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 gobby. Hey, Gob. I can't talk to you from there. Shut up, Nova. Good to see you again. Need a drink? Uh. Where did you come from? A place called Underworld. It's a ghoul city down in D.C. I set off up here to find adventure and fortune. And, well, I found this place. I'm sort of stuck here. Colin says that I can't leave until I pay off my debt to him. Of course, he charges me room and board, too. If you ever get to Underworld, tell Carol that I said hi. Hmm. Goodbye, Gob. Don't hit me. What the fuck? I guess I messed that up too. God damn it. Uh, what did I want to do? Isn't it here? Pretty sure it's in here. Just put on this ghoul mask.
Yeah, there it is. Matter that I'm wearing this. Thought I heard something. Oh man, I thought. Th more where that came from. Let's get out of here. Hey. God damn it, fucking dog meat. Oh, they don't have names. This looks an awful lot like the sniper thing. Apparently this is the guy that you sell fingers to. Where'd he go? Where the fuck did he go? Killed the rad roaches through the cage. Oh. It's right here. Hey, can you be nice? You. <laughs> the game didn't like that I killed him. crashes again I guess we can't kill him I don't want to kill him anyway but he's hostile it's his birthday look what we have here. all right we already like Got all this stuff. Well, that was weird. I thought I would have been able to talk to him. I guess not. Oh, not that way. Back to what we were doing. Fort Constantine. 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 Locked with Ted Strayer special key. Just Ted's. Door to launch control bunker. Dog meat, stop. It's just a protectron.
fuck. Grabbed cups. I want those. Gosh, I go out to grab clipboards. <laughs> Excuse me. Gas tweezers. What's in there? Painting mainland corroded. I'm gonna say it's carpeted. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Locked up so hardcore. There's nothing even good in here. Big book of science. I only have two more science books to get. Oh. Explosives book? We have a lot of explosives books to get. Launch control? CBM. I don't want to do that. This area. Where's that coming from? It's okay.
One red. Oh, there you are. Gosh, that weighs a lot. I get I take it the ICBM is the weapon that that Tempenny wanted. Kiwis do cards. Let's see what this looks like a very hard terminal. Infiltration. Broadcasting takes the whole thing up indefinitely. Oh. I wonder how much XP we would have gotten from that. Pick up a special weapon. No, sawed off shotgun. <laughs> guns and bullets. We got a small guns book. Technologies. Recuperating. Resurrection. Uh. Oh, fuck. God fucking damn it. Oh, yeah. It doesn't matter. Wow, okay. Shut up, radio. Shut up. to get this open. Fuck. Is it, do I have to move it? No. Almost didn't have to move it. F. Just the ammo room. Terra Warhead Dave's special key. Oops, took a stupid ass plunger again. Oh, 
Wait, I'll guess I'll go this way first. This was already open. Oh. Oh. Leads you in here. Yeah, what? We'll Not in progress anymore. Well, this is what it it brings you to. I could got I got in here before. Okay, I guess Dave's key was the most important key. This looks awfully familiar, doesn't it? Oops, I don't want that. I don't want that shit. Medicine. Two more for medicine. R&D terminal. Disable stasis field. We already have this armor. I don't know if I can wear this one. What the fuck? I can wear it. But this one breaks. So we gotta drop some weight. No. 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 I thought I picked up a lot more food than that. Oh. Sorry, dog meat. Well, we have special armor now. USA. USA. Megaton. Put this shit away. Wait, did I check off that we finished? Yeah, you gotta shoot him in the head. Trouble on the home front. I 
think I ate all my food already. I hope things are going well with you today, sir. And I also got all my nuka coals. Or drank all my nuka coals. Science, medicine, explosives, and small guns. What is lucky anymore? Doesn't matter. Um, I guess we can do Oasis next. chosen you in the next episode I am going to you do the oasis quest us, outsider so I will either wow I haven't said that in a while actually I will see you in the next episode thank you for watching I'll see you in the next episode